Hi everyone and welcome to the Inspire programming in Swift Challenges. We're looking forward to seeing how you guys progress over the next six challenges which we're doing over the six weeks. So let's get started. So today we're learning about commands and programming. To be successful you need to know what a command is and you need to be able to know how to use those commands in the correct order to complete programs. We're doing that in chapter one of the Playgrounds app. So first off, commands and programming, what are they? Well, straightforward guys, they are an instruction. And you have to understand that in programming, like in any set of instructions, we need to think about what what instructions we want to give and the order we give them in. So when we give a command, we're giving a program, a computer, an instruction. So let's think about that in something that you might be a little bit more familiar with, like a recipe. So let's think about making a pepperoni pizza. What are the steps in it? You know, first off, we know out the dough, then we cover the dough in pizza sauce, then we put the cheese on the sauce, then we place pepperoni on the cheese, then we put the pizza in the hot oven. Now, what happens if you follow those instructions perfectly in the right order is you should come up with a pizza. But if you don't follow those instructions in the correct order, or you make a mistake, you're not going to end up with your pepperoni pizza. You might end up with something a little bit different, different. So let's see what that might look like in programming. Programming is basically the same thing as following a recipe. So we're now going to be looking at how we program using our iPad. Now we're going to be doing that in Swift Playgrounds, which is this app with a little Firebird on it. I've started my programming task and I've given my little character a little job to get to. He's got to get this little red diamond in each of these levels. Now I've given him his set of instructions or in programming we call it commands. So we need to use all our commands to make our little character get to the diamond. You can see at the moment though he's a little bit short. Let's see what he does. So he moves forward three times and then he turns left and he moves forward another two times before he toggles the switch. Moves forward again and he teleports to the other end of the island. Now what you're going to be doing for each level is trying to figure out what commands you're going to give your character so he can successfully get the diamond. If you do it accurately and you give them the right commands in the correct order, you will have successfully programmed your character to collect the diamond. And you have started to learn how to program using commands. So fundamentally guys, a command is an instruction. So all those little instructions that we're giving our character are each of them a command. So when you finish this, you're gonna complete your workbook for your teacher and submit it. Remember, to make sure you're successful in programming, you need to make sure your commands are in the correct order and they're accurate. 